Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Game Aim Plus, where my aiming is gaming. I am your host, the boy G, and ooh, we gonna talk about it. Let's talk about it, okay? I ain't gonna hold y'all up any longer, you feel me? But, okay, here we go. Okay, I wanna give you guys a quick review on Metroid Fusion for the Game Boy Advance. But, it's on the Nintendo Switch online service expansion pack thingamajiggy you feel me so we're gonna talk about that all right so we're gonna get right into it all right so i beat the entire game okay i did it a few weeks ago honestly i probably should have did it earlier because i kind of some things kind of i forgot but we we gonna get into it okay so metroid fusion okay i I'm super, I, I, I was hyped when I found out it was coming to the Switch because I've always wanted to play Metroid Fusion but never got a chance to on the Game Boy Advance. I just never got it, okay? I always wanted to get into Metroid games but I just had a real slow process of it. And, but it's cool because I got to play it now. I beat the whole thing. I love the game, okay? Go get that right off, off it. Great game, I love it. I enjoyed myself. I was really on there. I was really, I was doing it. I was doing my Simon's thing. I love Samus. She is awesome. Okay. Now, as I was playing this game, I got a lot of um, Metroid Dread vibes, and gradually, the, the Fusion came out first. So technically, Dread kind of copied Fusion, but whatever. Okay. So Metroid Fusion. Um, same as always. You gotta go to like this spaceshipy place thingy, planetish thing. You gotta land there. You gotta get rid of it. Other the. the this 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 virus thingy that happened and it happened to Samus too in her body of her suit. It's 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 a little complicated shish kind of, but not really. So whatever, she gets like the, the the Metroid virus thing, whatever. And um so I'm trying to uh my best way of of of, of explaining it. Okay? So it's it's that your typical Metroid game, okay? Your same thing. You go land on this on a place from your little airshipy ship thing. You know, you gotta go find all your weapons again, all your items, all your connectical body stuff. You gotta you know, a Metroidvania game. You can't you can't get into certain areas until you get a certain weapon or ability. You can't get into that door. You see that door? Oh I can't you can't open it. You got you gotta go somewhere else. Sorry, you don't got the weapon you need for this door. Okay? Sorry. So it's it's a bit that's the only thing about Metroid games, I get that vibe of just, they're just all the same. And I'm just getting the same exact weapons. Like, it don't even be like new weapons. Sometimes, but, you know, it ain't like, like Zelda, like, I mean, you get the, I don't know, the Zelda weapons, they feel like you're getting a new, like a whole new, there's like a whole new set of weapons. But Metroid is like, I feel like I got the same weapons I got in the last game, the same way. Either way, I, lo I love the game. I enjoyed it. I'm glad I finally got a chance to play Metroid Fusion. Okay, and then um, and in this game, you have like this uh this copyish uh, uh Metroid thing that took over like your suit ish, and now it's living in it, and it's like a clone of you, and it's like walking around like the whole place. I mean, you gotta try to avoid it. Don't try to fight it, cause that that fake Samus will smoke you. And I, uh, the name of it is um, I think it's a S A X. Something like that. It's called SAX. So it's like a copy of you, but it's way stronger than you. It like it has all your powers that you originally had, and it smokes you. Okay, listen to me when I'm telling you this. Okay, hold on. <laughs> Pick my hair out, bro. Trying to get my, trying to get my flat top back. You feel me? R R I P Etika, baby. R I P Etika. Um. So, yeah, you want to run away from this uh thing that's hunting you down all over the place. Um, don't go near it. I've tried to fight it myself. Failed multiple times, absolutely multiple times. So don't do it. Um, it's a lot of good uh, boss battles. I like the boss battles. Honestly, the boss battles are they're pretty hard for me, anyways, because my eyes are horrible. So the bosses were actually kind of kind of hard. So luckily on the Nintendo Switch expansion pack, you know, we got that whole you know rewind, rewind, you know, rewind and do it over thing because I did that multiple times, especially on bosses because I wasn't trying to start all over. I'm too blind for that. So I'm actually very grateful of the whole rewinding, rewinding mechanic. Because that helps me a lot um, on the Game Boy Advance games. Because my eyes are not as good as they used to be when I was a young little little whippersnapper. You know? Not anymore. My eyes ain't there, baby. So, you know, so that really helped me a lot with all the bosses. Um, 
there was this one hard boss too in like the 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 tropical area like you get because you know they, they have like the you know the hot area the cold area the tropical area the, and it's always the same areas like that gotta they gotta change that too you know and you can't go into the hot area without getting the or the, you can't go in the hot and the uh the cold areas unless you update your 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 suit into the you know the temperature able to handle this you know thing so i just I, but it, it's, it's a great game okay the, just if you played a lot of Metroid games, it's, it's gonna just feel like the same thing. A um, couple of few new things, you know, but I I love the game. I'm glad I got to play it. Now I, I have a whole new Metroid game on my Metroid list of Metroid games that I've played and beaten, okay? I think I have like three or four of them on there. But I'm trying to build that up. Like I said, I really wanna, uh, really, really wanna get into Metroid games because I think they're, they're, they're good. Um, I just hope whatever Metroid Prime 4, they, they, they gotta switch something up. I don't know what they're gonna do, but it can't be like every other Metroid game. They gotta do something. Like, with Metroid, you're gonna have to do whatever, um, The Legend of Zelda did, you know, and they, they transferred it in like Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. Like, it, it was a complete transfer. They need to do something like that with Metroid. I don't know what, but they gotta figure it out. Um, but I, like I said, I love the game. It was a great game. Um, you, you, like I said, you go into you're in this spaceshipy planet thing, and you gotta go all the, all these different areas. You know, as is the typical. I think it's like I think I want to explain the game, but it's like I feel like I'm explaining every Metroid game. But you know, the colors of the game is they are great. Um, the old graphics they're still really nice. I like them. Um, and, and it's just, everything's vibrant and just everything moves perfectly. It's all good. Um, it, for it from coming from the Game Boy Advance to the Switch, see, I don't know because I never played on the Game Boy Advance, but it plays extremely well on the Nintendo Switch. I loved it. So if you guys want to go give it a chance, if you have the expansion pack, you know, the, 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 it's free basically. So go play it. Go play it real quick on the Game Boy Advance. Download that. Go play it and then try it out. You feel me? Um, you might like it. You might not. It all depends on you, baby. You feel me? But I enjoyed myself. So it was a great game. Um, I loved it. So. I would advise you, I would suggest it, I highly suggest if you want to try it out, try it out. It's free-ish, if you have it, you know. But, I just want to give y'all a quick, you know, a little review, you know, my thoughts, what I thought about the game when I finally got to play it and I was hyped. So, y'all go ahead, y'all play that. If you have played it, let me know in the comments how you felt about the game when you played it or, you know. But yeah, there you go, guys. Game Aim Plus, please subscribe, click that little bell button, that way every time I upload a new video, it'll pop up on your phone like... You feel me, dog? You feel me. But yeah, y'all have a great morning, afternoon, night, whatever it is, wherever you're at. And I'll catch you in the next one. Boo, y'all.